Okay guys, uh, today we're going to work on putting some of the stickers that I've received both at uh, Brad's Fire at the Furnace event and uh, from other uh, subscribers and uh, other YouTube uh, channels that also do similar things. Um, and we're going to put these stickers on and uh, some of them are going to be easier to put on than others. So we'll see uh, as far as peeling them and everything. So the first one I'm going to put on is Mount Tammany Ridge. And uh, uh, John uh, out there uh, actually reached out the other day and asked if he'd got, I'd gotten his sticker, which I did. I just, I've been waiting for a nice day. And actually it's nice today, but it's a little chilly. So my fingers may end up freezing up by the end of it. So this is one of the ones that doesn't have the split back. So uh, it's a little bit of a challenge. There you go. Whoop. Almost had it. There we go. So Mount Tammany Ridge. We're going to put these on the uh, conveyor today. We'll start out with that one right there. The next one that we have is Wal Walcott Family uh, Works. Uh, met them down at... Uh, Brad's event, and uh, I believe they were the ones that provided all of the food for the firewood at the furnace event, and it was really, really good. I'll put him right there. Next is a couple that um, I can't remember. I don't know if they got a YouTube channel or not, but they're a really nice couple. Camps Corners, met them down at... Uh, at Brad's event, they just really enjoy being around with the people and uh, anything to do with firewood, and he was enjoying himself, as was his wife. And so we'll put Camp's Corners right underneath Mount Tammany Ridge. Next one is the Hogs Logs, and I believe his name was Mike. So Mike and, uh, and his wife are a really nice couple. Uh, next one is, I'm sorry, Westway Firewood. And uh, this guy's got quite the operation. You might want to go check out his channel. Um, I'm holding the stickers up to the viewer instead of the actual camera. That would be helpful. We'll put him next to, uh, and his name is Paul. We'll put him next to Wolcott Family Works. And next is uh, Pete from uh, Premier Iowa Tree Surgeon. And I met him down there at Jack's, uh, down at the, the Fire to the Furnace before the event. And a uh, real nice guy. Go check his channel out. I think he finally went over a thousand, just went over a thousand subscribers. Okay, so the next guy is a, does kind of specialty wood, uh, Ken's Cuts, and he primarily does uh, smoker wood, and, uh, but makes some good money at it, it looks like. Um, really just caters down in the New Jersey area. Maybe, I don't know if he gets into Pennsylvania at all, but uh, people that want to be able to go out and enjoy uh, a good meal that they smoke themselves and they love his product so if you're down in that neck of the woods check him out he's also got a YouTube channel that you can uh, that you can find I'm gonna struggle with his sticker because it's square I don't don't know why some of these are harder than others but they are Just means I get to spend more time talking about Ken, I guess. But yeah, I met him down at uh, Fire with the Furnace. Very nice guy. Ah, there we go. Okay, so Ken, you got a prominent place right there on the uh, STK24. Next is Will from W, uh, also known as WD30 Adventures. And Will just started a channel. Uh, it's, uh, 
it's a good channel. He's been involved in a lot of the broadcast for a while. Um, real nice guy, down to earth. Uh, they give him a hard time about his husky chainsaws, but well, I have huskies. I've always had huskies, and uh, there's nothing wrong with them. They're great saws, and uh, right up there, and I would say even better than steel. Start a little controversy here. Okay, the next one has guy that has one that will never fade. It's uh, John from Frick Frickin' Jeep, and I used to just think that was his the name of his channel. I didn't know his sawmill was a Frick Mill. And uh, and so it was kind of interesting when I found that out. But his is made out of metal, and uh, he's got a good YouTube channel. He goes about a million miles an hour um, with eight different projects, ten different projects all at the same time, and a uh, real fun guy to uh, to watch. I wish I had. I hope I have the energy I had that he has when I'm his age. Not that I'm that far away. Okay. We'll put that guy over here. Some of these are bigger than others. So if you have a channel and you have a smaller sticker, I could use some for this side. Um, and I believe the final one that I hit, oh, no, I got one more after this. Uh, this is old guy firewood with Dick. And uh, met Dick down at the firewood at the furnace. Once again, these people are just a lot of fun to be around. Um, Got to have uh, uh, some uh, dinner with Dick. Uh, we we had a bunch of us that went out before the fire at the furnace event, and uh, he was uh, he was having fun on the uh, the uh, East different Easter made. Uh, wipe this off here. He was having fun on a lot of the different Easter made uh, splitters that were there. So. Uh, Anyways, this is all we have for today, guys. If you have a stick here, oh, one more. I keep forgetting. So, Brad, I'm not sure how long this is going to last. Uh, somehow it ended up in my back pocket and went through the laundry one or two times. But uh, it appears to still have a little bit of stick -em on there. So we're going to try to put it on. And if it doesn't make it, it doesn't make it. But we'll, we can always replace it next year. So I did... It's funny, the paper started peeling apart here, but not from the stickum, just from uh, from itself. So I did get it started earlier, so I know that there's some sticky stuff underneath. There it is. Okay. So I think I can... And so it's not a firewood at the furnace sticker, it's a fellowship at the furnace sticker. And it's going to be too big for there, so I'll move it over here. Yeah, I may need another one, Brad, just so you know. Rub it a little bit, see if we can get it to stay, at least for a while. Okay, I got one more sticker that uh, I forgot I had in the car because I received it uh, this past week. And it's Jeremiah from Outdoors in the 608. So, Jeremiah, we're going to put you... Over here, underneath Ken's cuts. And the other one that I forgot to put on is my own sticker, Adirondack Woodsman. If you guys want one of these, uh, shoot me an email and uh, with your address and I'll get one out to you. You always forget yourself. I'll put mine under uh, the firework, or fr Fellowship at the Furnace. I was going to say Firewood at the Furnace. There we go. So there we have it. All the new stickers on the SDK24 uh, adorning the uh, the uh, conveyor with uh, some additional things to beautify it. Hope you guys have a great day. So anyway, that's what we have today for stickers, guys, uh, from all some of the different YouTube channels I get out of the way. But uh, if you uh, have one of these, have a YouTube channel, or even if you don't have a YouTube channel but you got a sticker, you want to throw it on the conveyor, um, go ahead and uh, send it to me, and we'll get it on there. But, uh, yeah, so thanks, everybody, for, uh, for
for tuning in and uh, have a great day, great week, and uh, cut a lot of firewood out there. Talk to you soon.